am thrilled to kick off this celebration by introducing the inaugural NEA Foundation Student Voices for Education Award. We are super excited about this new award category created to recognize the importance of student voice and student leadership. This award honors the ultimate stakeholders, whether one student, a group, an organization, any that serve as a driving force for elevating students, advocating for their right to a quality public education. I'm going to ask Valerie to join me on stage for this presentation. I want to introduce to you an organization that began in 2012 through Twitter exchanges. And now it has grown into a national organization that believes that to achieve equity in schools, power must be authentically and meaningfully shifted to the youth most marginalized in our education system. They are empowering and positioning youth across the country to use their voices as agents of social and political power. I promise it's not coincidental, but the recipient of the first ever NEA Foundation Student Voice Award is to an organization that's named Student Voice. <laughs> Please put your hands together and welcome Lee Walden and Nina Jackson, who are accepting this award on behalf of Student Voice. told me about the hype music. Um, we are so, so grateful to be with you guys tonight. Um, a couple, well, maybe a decade younger, but we're so grateful to be here tonight and to be recognized. <laughs> student Voice, student, student Voice has been working in the field of education equity for over a decade now. Um, but we can truly say that this current moment that educators and students are facing is filled with the most challenges we've ever been forced to confront. Across the country, public schools are grappling with understaffed classrooms, underrepresented students, and communities filled with confusion, pain, and vitriol. And politicians who continually put their own agendas above the needs of our students and our nation. Though if the work of students that engage with student voice prove anything, it is that young people have always found ways to rise to a challenge. This award, an award recognizing the importance of engaging and uplifting students, is proof that students are gaining greater relevance and are starting to truly be centered at issues of education and school equity. <laughs> While it's easy to believe that increased interest in education, either in the news or in our communities, has caused more problems by reigniting the polarization on school issues, the participation and intention of every single community member of public schools can only make our system of learning more informed, relevant, and most importantly, empathetic. Still, as student voice is shifting through at this current moment, how to center those who are most often erased in silence is ongoing and complex work. So making space to ask those hard questions, embracing humility to hear answers you didn't know, being bullied by someone who doesn't know as much about you, <laughs> and allowing those individual spaces and opportunities within your organizations is critical. Bettering ourselves is how we build a better education system with more empowered young people who truly have all of their resources to make their voices heard. Thank you again so much for your recognition and support. <laughs> <laughs> 